Alright, Kenny's I am in Times Square and as predicted, I didn't think anything was going to happen. I know how they like to sensationalize everything nowadays, and that's exactly what happened. Just a bunch of hype. This is Times Square. You can see behind me. I don't see two feet of snow. I'm going to turn around this way. I don't see two feet of snow anywhere. All a bunch of hype. Travel bans have been lifted. We're traveling to Atlantic City today, as uh, I expected that I would. We live in a time when everything is sensationalized, and the mayor of this uh, city is a global warming uh, nut, and he believes there's going to be a storm that's going to kill everybody and flood the place and do all kinds of stuff. Well, didn't happen today. Didn't think it was going to happen. These guys hype for ratings, people. It's all, it's how the weather works right now. And uh, it's all hype. You can see, looks normal behind me. Nothing but a bunch of hype, ladies and gents. That's right. All right, so this video is from about three o'clock in the morning. I stuck my GoPro out the window. Uh, so you can see what it looked like uh, from our hotel room window. We're 26 floors, 25 floors up. And you can see that it is snowing, but it's not blizzard-like conditions by far. The real, the surreal thing is there's no traffic. You see there's no taxi cabs moving. There's really nothing moving. They had a band where it was nothing but emergency vehicles. And as you can see, there was really nothing going on down in Times Square. Uh, I had some good things that I saw that I'll put on here, some cool things, and some tragic stuff that I'll uh, put following this. All right, ladies and gents, here's some of the great things I saw. A great snowball fight in Times Square last night. These kids were from Texas, a debate team, and they had a great time. Um, this is a pos what I would consider a positive. Uh, you're going to see the negative in a moment. Um, these kids uh, did this snowball fight for over an hour. I will have a separate video on this on YouTube. And uh, they were so excited. This is the tragedy. This poor guy right here, he really got it. This is a uh, famous snowboarder, and he's taking advantage of Times Square and the slow traffic to have pictures made, which is a positive, I thought. That was really cool. Then I saw New York's finest, the uh, fire department, uh, with a actually a fire in the manhole. And I asked them about it, and they said that during big storms, a lot of times uh, the methane will catch on fire inside the manhole, and that's what this is. Uh, and so they said it was not unsafe, they just wanted to check it out and they uh, did some stuff to stop it. And another tragedy was the uh, original soup Nazi. He was closed, that's the place, it's called the Soup Man, he's the, the one that they, Seinfeld got the idea from. Um, and he was closed, unfortunately, because I would love to have some soup. It was late at night and it was snowing, so that's why uh, he was closed. Chewbacca all alone on Broadway. But you know what? He found some friends. I can't do a very good Chewbacca. Another tragedy was people making dogs wear shoes. Starbucks was closed. I had to settle on this and man it's not the same thing. And I had to see Geraldo a lot in Times Square. He's a legend in his own mind. And also people hitting New York's finest with snowballs. Uh, that was uh, kind of interesting. Yeah, going back. 